So, I all, always a pleasure to come on and share this work and share my views and share these transmissions and really just wanted to come on and really get into this, what's going on and playing out, especially the, the coronavirus and the fear and the panic and just, you know, really, you know, come from a place of knowing, I'm, I'm a trauma-informed practitioner, I, I work with, a, you know, internal family systems therapy, which is really about, you know, our deepest wounds and our deep, the parts of us that hold our deepest tr traumas and, you know, what, what is happening out there is, you know, is triggering our vulnerable wounds and really getting into our own, you know, deep wounds and on a collective level as well, especially the fear of death, you know, and, and just powerlessness and just a lot of, you know, this really is triggering a lot of us uh, right now, you know, and I work with, you know, breath techniques and to help self-regulate and bring in uh, you know, flow back into the system, back bring in self-energy. You know, and I work multidimensionally as well in my languages and hold space with people and really help them integrate and, and to clear what clear any energies and residues and help them and timelines multidimensionally. So I want to come on today and just really get into this and assist from, from what I know I, I have, you know, I do a lot of work with deep trauma and, you know, uh, from you know, a professional point of view is what I do and this really is triggering us, our wounds, our deepest parts of us and this then taps into you know you know into our nervous system as well our sympathetic nervous system you know we start in the fear the panic we start start getting into the fight or flight it starts to release adrenaline adrenaline which is not helpful for our, our systems our immune systems our digestion keeps us in panic mode and you know this accelerates heartbeat and we just we, our pupils dilate and we really get into this sense of this fear this primal fear and that that has been with us since time and just you know this this is what's playing out right now and and in, and obviously the parts as well you know i don't know the work that i do on understanding parts and how extreme parts you know they, they have these burdens all our wounds all our fears all our beliefs and what's being triggered right now and what happens is if the panic and the anxiety comes in we're actually blended with these parts of us and they flood into it, you know, they take, hijack our nervous system and we start to, you know, respond and feel and be and perceive from these parts of us that really hijack us. These younger, vulnerable parts that really need our attention. You know, and, you know, I, I come from a place of knowing with this work that I do. And I just wanted to come on and give some assistance today. Um, you know, I work with breath techniques as well and, and just, this multi-dimensional languages so it's really just give, give something back and uh, you know really help and, and, and on a you know a very basic level uh, this is happening to obviously you know a root chakra all our fears and, uh, and it's a basic survival and it's really bringing us back in and I really want to you know not get into too much of the story story around everything the pandemic and everything that's going on just wanted to help alleviate what is here right now and you know for anyone who feels overwhelmed and this is going to be bringing up a lot for, for many many people um, and what I'm going to bring through is not bypassing and the you know sugar coating and really really people need to do their own deep internal work uh, as well while this is going on got going on to really get into this within our in ourselves so we can clear this for, for, the, for the collective so you know, I really want to take you on a bit of a uh, transmutation journey right now uh, to clear some of this, what what can be cleared. Like I said, it's not bypassing or sugarcoating or one it wonder. This is deep stuff that could probably come through. Ancestral lines being triggered now as well. Legacy burdens, things passed down. And just, yeah, this is bringing up, up, up it all for everyone. And I just really want to give you a space, a moment. We're going to work with the elements. We're going to do like a shamanic unburdening as well on the guide you to. We're going to be working with the fire elements, bringing the sun, so light a candle. Right now, if you would like to uh, assist with the transmutation of any fear, any beliefs, you know, and really, I want to soothe your system and, and, and get you into some self-regulation uh, to bring you back into the present moment. And I want to take you through, to start with a breath technique that will bring help you access and process things quicker and, and really help you integrate and, and give you more space and clarity more peace and more processing power in the mind and so trust me with this 
what's the word that I do? And, and then I'm going to take you uh, 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 with, in a shamanic unburdening, uh, we can work with the languages to release uh, and put this and transmute whatever is here for you in the fire. So I thank you, I welcome you to, to my voice will be with you with this breath te specific breath technique, it's quite simple. I just want to let you know on the out breath, just fully empty your lungs. And when you breathe in, just breathe in so you, you know you feel you feel it back into your spine. So you're breathing all the way in so you get a nice posture way with where you are as well. And the breath if you really suck this in and breathe this in and make the most of this technique. So we're gonna be working with three seconds in and three seconds out. And I just want to, to guide you and into this experience. So get connected with where you are, where you're feeling right now. Get into this moment. And I want you to, to empty your lungs. And we're gonna be breathing in through the mouth and out through the mouth, three seconds. In through the mouth and then out through the nose. In through the nose and out through the nose. In through the nose and out through the mouth. In through the mouth and out through the mouth. I want to relax the belly. And I want you to breathe in. Hold. Breathe it again. Hold. Breathe in one more time. Hold as long as you can and then let go. And just allow that space, allow that feeling. Maybe you look slightly altered, maybe you're resting your lungs, maybe you feel like you want to yawn, whatever it is. And obviously with these breath techniques we can go deeper and deeper and deeper into this. Uh, but right now it's just a quick, quick technique before I take you on, you know, to release whatever's here for you, the fear, the panic, the overwhelm. So we're getting into the right state of mind to process this quicker. And I want you to know I want you to feel in whatever's been up for you, the fear, you know, the fear of death, the fear of the powerlessness, or all the fears, the triggers, what has arisen for you in, in, in this manifests in the body, because it's where the parts resound in our organs, in our muscle fibres and tissues, in our, you know, this is where we store our trauma in the body, so I want you to feel into the body, where, where do you feel it right now? What has been up for you? What has arisen? Breathe into it. Just focus on it. Maybe if you could give it a colour, if it does have a colour, give it a colour right now. So you can map it out. The internal system can map this out. This part, this sensation that you're feeling right now. And if really just breathe into it to let it know that you're here. The sensation is part of you carrying your beliefs and feelings, perspectives that is overwhelming. What, is it, what, what has arisen? I just want to place your attention on it right now. And I want to let that, you know, part know that we're on these fears that has arisen now. It's a time, a place now you can feel some safety. And I'm going to bring in a shamanic unburdening in a sense. I'm going to bring in a fire right now. So perceive and sense a fire being brought in, in your mind's eye. Anything, you know, you can bring in the sun 
we gonna use the fire element? Can you put, you know, imagine, sense, know, experience? The fire being with you right now. And whatever your fears or whatever is arisen, this is a safe place and a moment in time to release whatever has been brought up in the, you know, for you in a safe place. And what can be released right now in your beliefs and feelings, sensations. And I'm gonna work with my languages now to, to assist you to release and hold you in a space of grace and love. So whenever you are ready to let this go, allow yourself to let this go. And just breathe in. Breathe out. And receive. Allow yourself to let this go into the fire to be transmuted. Believe, no, feel, not letting go is as easy as this. Show no, 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 Let this go. Allow yourselves to let this go. The fear, the flooding, the overwhelm. It's time to come together. Don't let, allow this to separate you. This is time to unite, to come together with compassion, to really check in on each other now. It's time to, for you to unite reunite as one don't allow the fear don't allow these paradigms this illusion to overwhelm you and flood you and shut you down it's time to unite it's time for compassion it's time to connect with the vulnerable people the vulnerable parts of you and 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 really check in with compassion and love help people now and and really connect with people who are in fear Spread your light, spread the baton of love, this baton of self, be the spark in other people's lives in times of fear and panic. Just really trust in the love that you are and that you have this, you've got this right now. And take whatever precautions are necessary to navigate this path with 
respect and responsibility and don't buy into the fear but also take precautions for yourself bolster your immune systems with the right foods and ingredients and the love take time for yourself and your family really look after yourself and your bodies to assist in whatever is needed you know really look after yourselves right now you know come back to yourselves clean up your diet clean up your mind have a mental detox refresh let go and really come back and support each other unite in times of fear and panic it's time remember who you are beloved remember who you are we are here with you to assist you and call for us we're a whisper away so thank you for trusting thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you just really want to you know honor the moment to share any people that need assistance get in touch um, around the work that I do and you know this is time for internal you know to do the internal work to really get into what's been triggered within yourself to really honor that to love that to see what's arisen for your attention this is self-sovereignty this is radical self-responsibility in these times it's to, time to come in to reflect to see what's playing out in your world in your internal world your internal system so i just really want to thank you for being with me on this transmission and i'm going to be bringing a lot more uh, through and maybe doing some live um transmissions around this stuff and bringing through the wisdom that i know to be true that i work with daily and just really assisting people now in these times so uh, i want to thank you uh, it's my pleasure and i'm here for you so sending many blessings you take care in times and let you know sending my love you take care